Hello and welcome to the USF 2000 at Summit Point Raceway. We've got our brake bias back because there's some serious uh, braking zones here and I uh, don't want to lock up the tires. And uh, we've got a little bit of experience too because this is actually uh, my second attempt. Attempt number one, I somehow managed to get rear-ended on a straightaway. The guy just drove right through me. I don't know. I really don't have any explanation for it. I guess he was going for the pass and just decided too late that he was going to do it. And, uh, well, you don't really get a second chance in this car, so. And that was really early on, so there's really no video to watch. And I knew I wanted to try this again anyway, so hopefully this time we don't get rear-ended on a straight. <laughs> Not much uh, I can do to control that, though. I, I, I guess I could have hit the nitrous <laughs> so he couldn't reach me. I don't know. But uh, that was unfortunate. Now I just got to try to uh, stay on track. I'm not all that fast. Could be worse, though. I'm content. Green, green, that was green. maybe not the greatest turn right there, but... Okay, here comes your first time we'll see what we can get out of it. Don't think I'm uh, capable of my car number at P3. Don't think that's going to happen. You know, I'll do my best, though. This turn gets me good. I go so slow through there, but uh, anytime I try to push it harder, I end up wrecking. So I'm going to just have to be steady there. And I uh, can't do much more than that. This one's, this corner is really easy to mess up as well. And uh, it gets a little light as well through here. So I try not to spin out. But uh, it's pretty fun to drive through uh, if you get it right. So let's try to get it right more often than not, huh? About three tenths off of my best lap at the moment. Oh shoot, it didn't go. It didn't shift down. I had to shift a little too early, so I messed up that corner. One more lap. All right, not the best lap, but uh, it didn't completely destroy it. <laughs> so let's try again this time. This lap. My uh, best lap isn't exactly all that great anyway. But, uh, hey, okay, that was okay through there. About as good as I have been able to get it. So far, uh, this lap's much better. Well, maybe not much better, but somewhat better. Crack it like there. Ooh. Kind of got unsettled through that whole section that ruined my time. Found myself out of position. So uh, maybe this level won't be better. Nah, that was all. <laughs> that was terrible. First half of the lap was okay, second lap was stinky poo poo. So I guess I might as well get a little bit of extra practice since I clearly need it. Alright, just gotta find the right balance of uh, getting onto the throttle at the right time and uh, not doing it too late either because you don't want to spin out on the same uh, on the same note. A little hard through there. Gotta remember to hit the brakes for that corner during my first attempt. I uh, had a bad habit of not hitting the brake over there because I think I'm used to driving the Mazda through there and there you kind of just do a tiny little brake tap and let it roll a little bit. Gotta not do that. And also you don't want to get your left sides off past the curb there. 
that'll slow you down really bad because the other side of that curb is super bumpy and having half your car off of it does not do you any favors. So we'll go ahead and park it. We're eighth. Yeah, not very fast. Try to survive it though. And uh, you can get places in this series as long as you survive it. It, is, uh, it doesn't take much for these things to get uh, wrecked. So if I hit my all-time best, I would have been top five. Instead, we're P8. And uh, is number one done with their laps? They are. So even the number one is back there. It's interesting. I think I'll just go for the top ten. If I can get that, I think I'll feel pretty good. And uh, not get uh, crashed this time. Got to make it the full 15 with 15 minutes. 12 and the 14 have not yet indicated that they're ready. Assume the this guy's doing his lap. And the 14. They messed up lap one, so maybe they're doing their lap. This might be single split. I'm thinking it might be. I don't I don't remember how many people were signed up, but it wasn't a huge number. I wouldn't be su surprised if it was 18. Or maybe it split once. I think it might have split once, actually. Even though we got, like, Rookie in here, I think it split once. Not that it matters too much. Um, it's not like we got cautions or anything, like a, an over race. So, we don't have to deal with that. I've got my brake bias farther back than I ever put it. I got it 50.1 because, like I mentioned briefly before, uh, you got those heavy braking zones, and it's very, very easy to lock up the brakes. And uh, I haven't had any trouble with uh, spinning out under braking. Famous last words. But uh, so far, I've not had that issue. So I'm pretty comfortable with uh, having the brakes where they are right here. Anyway, we got about 20 more seconds for these guys to not hit the button or complete their laps. Not sure what the story is there. Some people just like waiting, I guess. They love the anticipation. They live for it. I don't know. But uh, we're ready to go anyway. Oh yeah, and by the way, pace laps here, as usual, are an absolute nightmare. Road series pace laps are just the scariest thing, probably more scary than the race itself. Don't know why people being absolutely crazy go, with <laughs> like warming up their tires and all that. It's <laughs> it's probably what I um what's the word? It's probably what I dread the most. That's the word I was looking for about uh, entering these races. I mean, it's one thing to get wrecked during. Uh, Good luck, everybody. Have fun. During the race, it's another thing to have to dodge people during the pace laps. I forgot. I forgot we got a fast repair. I thought we didn't get a fast repair in this series. Hmm. I don't know why I thought that. What series am I thinking of that doesn't give you fast repairs? I don't remember. The time I got wrecked, though, I was just like. I just exited it. I didn't feel like continuing after that. Probably not the right thing to do. And I lost about a hundred I rating on the roadside because of it, but I don't think I was going to pass too many more people. I don't know that, though. Um, I don't know that for sure. But I just kind of, I didn't feel like continuing the race. I was a little frustrated, and uh, I just wanted to enter something else. I wanted to do some racing. Maybe one day soon we'll be able to Hit this button. <laughs> this rain button. Had some more uh, teaser images not too long ago. It's coming. 15 the storm's minutes. a brewing, you could say. Is 96 Fahrenheit. And I'm not just talking about the pace laps or this race. I mean a literal storm. Oh no. Follow My connection. 13 in the right column. 
That's bad. Uh oh. That's real bad. That's really bad connection right now. Just a moment. Let's see if I can figure this out. Okay, I just <laughs> figured out what it was. It was my fiance. Uh, uploading or something. But, uh, got it figured out. Uh, we had, we didn't miss anything except whatever just happened there. We had someone break checking someone. I'm just giving way too much room because I don't trust <laughs> anyone around me. Gotta survive the rest of this pace lap. So far, so good. Some room behind us. my brakes a little bit maybe in a way that's not brake checking people just dragging them a little ready. bit going green. I don't know how much that's going to affect anything for real but that's not cool. this slowing down you're not supposed to do that it's very uncool of them come on man this is clown behavior Flag, green flag. 15 minutes left, that's 15 minutes. Yeah, you gotta maintain pace speed, that's not, it's just uncalled for. So we just gotta take it easy now, we got people in front of us, don't want to run them over. Uh oh, we got crashing ahead, yeah, really? Plenty of crashing ahead, holy smokes. What was the point of that? You just dove it in for no reason. Like, you weren't even there, I was turning into the corner, you just completely covered me. Sounds like someone made a dive bomb. Stop me if you've heard that one before. Can you believe it? Those are some free spots, though. Nick, I thought I was going to be able to chase you down. I had to get start, but other people didn't want that, I guess. Nope. No one thinks. Keep it nice and smooth. So we are in seventh now. Why I kind of hate high racing, to be honest. Overdrove that a bit, but we're fine. Yeah, it gets annoying. At least we got some space, that's really nice. It's enough space to overdrive corners. Perfect. Just what I needed. Did you do another one? Yeah, probably. You're East Coast, man. That's <laughs> probably like, what, like, up for you? Yeah, it's 11 o'clock, but the kids are finally in bed, and Joyce is in bed, so I can go play. That guy went yeah, live. Just done it. 109.2. 109.2 oh, is a little above my pay grade. Oh no, we got crash. Okay, so the guy that wrecked me just pulled over and gave up, I guess. 
He had eagle eyes on the guy that wrecked him, giving him fad juju. <laughs> We got 1.1 behind us, 1.8 in front of us. Let's keep it on the track. I think we can get a decent finish if we do. Find out if I can listen to myself. Follow my own advice. Half bad through that section. And you're gonna go run with the cave boys. Yeah, so I did the. You know, there are a little bit of whiteness uh, there. Running over them, and I'm gonna do the Indianapolis races in May. And so where we are, where are we now? Six. Alright, moving forward. It's just I want to count as a rookie for 2023. Once we have like a full budget put together. Catching this he number seven as well. Not cheap. Right, because he's on the mic so much. Neither is parting, but you know, we get through that. Ooh, a little bit of loose there. That got scary. The Gensel. Capes are great. I mean, them and Augie Paps. You're looking like people. Yeah, yeah really good though. About Paps, but Feeling okay with my pace right now. You know, I know I know Jagger and them, and I like the guys that are running over their team and what they've done. You know. I think this guy's gone off every <laughs> every lap on that corner. I think it'll be a good start. These are so fun to drive, though. They've been around a long time. Oh, yeah. But the lineup doesn't really seem to be that stacked this year. Looking at it, I mean, you got, like, Nebu and a few others, but it's not Ooh, how it used to be with Brooks and all of them. How is this guy driving while talking? How do you do that? I don't know how people do that. Yeah, I mean, it's got its cycles. <laughs> That's so crazy right. to me that That's they can, like, have a whole conversation. Like, there's no way I can multitask like that. Maybe it's just because I'm less experienced on road. Maybe these guys, it's, like, second nature. But I cannot do that. No way. I was going to do the spring test over at Homestead, but I got, uh, ran over at, what's it called? That, uh... Excuse me, so uh, kind of took me out of it. What happened? You got ran over in the final? Yeah, just normal senior stuff. Somebody hit a patch of water and just completely just blew past the corner in the hairpin and I ended up taking the heat of it. Nothing got nothing got bent, so I finished like eleventh or something. Sarah's messing around because he's talking. All right. Still there. Clear on the right. That was a carding race. Come on, find the gap. Yeah. That was like a homestead. What time are you flying out for Orlando? Or are you? I mean, it's not that bad of a flight from where are you from. This should be our chance here, I think. Well, maybe not. We're not quite there yet. Uh, I think we get in Orlando at like nine something. Stay on the ride. I get in at like six in the morning on Saturday, so I gotta fly on the red eye. Oh. But you're leaving Saturday. I didn't want to overdrive it. Yeah. All right, Colton. Halfway home. Fuel looks I'll probably camp for tomorrow. Nice, that's going to be fun one. It's kind of bothering me. I, I should move the love your chat, reading. like their names, Indie dude. It's career. covering up my, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I 
But do we have to have this conversation, like, right now? Exactly. Yeah, there's no better time. We're all friendly here. PSF. D-Class. It's just fun. Are you pressing the wrong button, Wade? What's going on? <laughs> Is this mind game? What? Finally. Uh, you've been pitting in for a while now. <laughs> oh, sorry, I had no idea what's going on. Look what I figured. Sector 2 is not protected off the fence. I'm like, 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 I'm I mean, he's defending his position, but my god, I'm so stuck behind him, and it's just irritating me a little that he's more interested in talking than racing. P6. Stop that section really bad. Not that bad. Car right. Stay on the left. Let's see how well you can make this thing. Your up times are increasing. Come on, keep your focus. Stay on the left. Clear on the right. Come on, keep oh. it. Oh. He can pass the chatterbox. Making mistakes anyway. Okay, Colton, five minutes to go, five minutes left. bit there. Probably helps to have someone uh, in front of me. Okay, still missing up that corner every lap. Grabbing a couple frames there for a little bit. P7, the gap behind is now 1.6. That lap time was 109.9. That's your quickest lap in this session. Ah, oh, I was surprised that I could keep you off for that long. Got a bit of front wing. Yeah, we can catch up here. I like the outside move, Tyler. Right side. Clear on the right. Well, he messed up the corner, so I had to turn hard left to try to get by him, and it snapped on me. So, Chatterbox wins. <sighs> Between us, I guess. Broken front wing, so now we're gonna be slower and less good <laughs> in general. Just couldn't make it one. Uh... The gap in front has increased. It's now about 7.8 seconds. One of these races without crashing. At least we're still going. I just gotta be real careful now, because I don't know exactly how this car's gonna react in its damaged state. It's 
It's not turning quite as good, I don't think. Uh, oh, and now it's looking like we're gonna finish right where our uh, we finished in the touring car in 12th. Each time we got a minute 40, so probably uh, two laps to go, I suppose. That lap was at 111.2. Yeah, it's just not like cutting through the air as well as it should be, I think, without that uh, front wing. And uh, they don't seem like they're wrecking anymore. Up there. White flag. Yep, as predicted, white, white flag. So I almost made it to the end without crashing. But uh, I just, it so happened that the guy made that mistake white flag. during white probably the most uneasy part of the course. In terms of uh, having a snap like that and uh, tried to move to his inside rather than hit the brakes for him as he made another mistake because he won't get off the microphone. And uh, I messed it up. I turned the wheel too much and it caused it to snap. Great race, guys. Could have been worse, though. Still better than the uh, first attempt. Yep, get right. Good race. Right. Good race, you guys. Do you want St. Pete? St. Pete, bring it. Can't wait. <laughs> Puff of smoke here. Apparently, someone went off or something, but. Uh, can't uh, capitalize on it, so that's P12. Not good. We done did crash. We're gonna start out on Only two X. I don't want to hear you talking anymore. Have enough of that for one race. Uh, eh, could been worse. Like I said, Let's see uh, incidents. So that's where he broke his wing. Now he had like a stack up here that causes more issues for guys. That was right in front of me. Ooh, hit that curb and that got it all messed up for him. me. The guy messes up. You see him skid the tires. Gets on the brakes too hard. And I'm like, alright, I'll cut down below him, but then it snaps on me. So, thank you for being more concerned with your conversation than racing. Obviously, that's my fault. But, still a little irritated I got stuck behind him making mistakes almost the whole race. But that's it. Otherwise, it was pretty clean. So I was one of the few that decided to crash. Fair number of incidents, but I bet most of those are just uh, off tracks. All right, that'll do it for this one. Might try some more on my own time. But uh, that's what we got here. Not such a great finish. Oh, well, still enjoy the car. 
and uh, I'll be back next week. And uh, hope to see you there. Thanks for watching.